Andy, thanks for joining us after the uh, morning session on a on a Tuesday. What board are you with the backs working on over there with you? Uh, they've, they've just come out of a, a very productive meeting this morning, and uh, well, we've we've tended to focus on uh, on New Zealand. Yesterday we had a backs meeting, which just focused on us and getting our, our game right. Uh, this morning was more uh, about New Zealand and what they're going to bring and how we're going to impose ourselves onto them. So we back up the session with what we've talked about in the meeting. A bit of skills based stuff, a bit of orientation for what we want to try and get out of uh, this afternoon session as a team as well. Can you give a sense of the, the mood among the players? Can you give a sense of what they feel as they're building up to such a big game as this? At the moment, they're, they're, they're just hell-bent on, on making sure that they understand um, uh, what we want to do as a team and how we can impose ourselves on, on, on New Zealand. Um, they've been absolutely great over the last week. Uh, their application to, uh, to train into the work ethic of, of making sure that the, there is a great understanding amongst themselves it has, has been first class. So we sense that it's one of, uh, of, of, of real excitement about the challenge that's coming up. What's the mentality when you play against a team that's beaten you four times in a row? How, how do the players approach a challenge like that? Well, it's, it's the ultimate challenge. It, it, you know, we, we, we said it over the last uh, two or three years that when we play against New Zealand, you know that you've got to be at your best. You know, this time round we play them, we play them first up, which is always a challenge at any any um, uh, stage of a stage of a competition. So we've got to make sure that we we concentrate on on our preparation so that. You know we can we can uh, perform uh, first up uh, against what is the, the best side in the world at the minute. Is there excitement amongst the group? Is there excitement about what's to come? There's some players playing really well in the Premiership, which is important. They and they carry that form on. It is. Uh, the, the, it's been a great start. We've been lucky enough to, to delay selection uh, so that we can uh, see the form of, of, of people in the, in the first six weeks. Um, so people are coming in in great spirits, you know, happy with their own game. But they do also realise that the, the, the step up in the step up in the intensity and, 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 and the white hot pressure that comes with international uh, rugby, the scrutiny of it all, is something that uh, is, is, uh, is, a, is a big step up for everyone. But the way that they've prepared, they, they realise that step up and they're ready to take it, take it on. How difficult is that step up? How difficult is it to go from Premiership to big European games and then up to the ultimate level of Test Rugby? Well, look, we've tried to prepare them uh, the best we could with, with high, intense, pressured uh, training sessions. The lads have absolutely loved it and they've been fantastic over the last week. You get your preparation right, it stands you in great stead on the weekend. New Zealand are noted, or widely noted for scoring lots of tries over turnover ball and kick returns. Is it as simple as one of the things you've got to get right is kicking well and not turning the ball over too much? Don't, don't turn the ball over, <laughs> would do. Yeah, no, you're exactly right. They're, 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 they're red hot on that. and. Uh, um, they, they know how to strike quickly and uh, we're not worried too much about them because we, we, we've played against them uh, a lot uh, in, in the past and we know what the strengths are but we, as I said we, we need to impose ourselves on, on them as well and let them worry a, bit, a little bit about us. Lunch time coming up, is coming up but you don't get much lunch to you as coaches. What, <laughs> what have you got to do between now and training this afternoon? Uh, we've got a meeting that I need to go in now and prepare for this afternoon and then we've, uh, we've got a, a counter-attack defence session this afternoon as well so um, trying to make sure that there's plenty in the legs for this afternoon with the boys this morning and uh, we'll ramp up the intensity etc and uh, they'll have a day off tomorrow to get over it and then the Thursday, Friday they'll be just refining things a little bit, they'll be ready for the weekend. Do you, do you look forward to those meetings? What are they like to, to front up and do? No, the, the, they are the great because uh, we've got such a good group that everyone yeah, wants to come and learn, you know, and uh, and, and get better every day. So, uh, the great lads, great work ethic, take everything on board, and ultimately they they get stuck in and try and make it happen on on the training pitch. And we've been pretty good at that over the last week. Cheers, Danny. Thanks for your time and good luck this afternoon. Cheers. Thanks, thanks a lot.